right, I started pulling this off last night. We got that, that amount to go, get that fan down, and then maybe we can start on construction instead of destruction. Uh, what I've been doing with that, I got that big long deal right there. Look at that, I just reach up. Well, it looked easier. Yeah. Take out the screws. Simple as that, man. But there's so many screws. My neck still hurts from working last night. We're gonna get uh, all of this off. And I gotta move Rooster's food. Or they're gonna end up with screws in it. All right, let's get busy, man. I ain't got time to sit here and yak with you. Hey, this is right up there with painting. Yeah, <laughs> mowing grass. It's right up there with that. Oh, I just got bit by a little bit of electricity. Yeah. I knew the switch was off, but I touched the switch wire. Yeah, it wasn't. So I turned the breaker off, disconnected the fan, and we're good. Now, in case you're wondering why there's a big gaping hole right here, and I'll put a picture in of what this looked like before. This used to be a pantry. And it came all the way out to here. And I ripped the pantry out. And uh, so it did never have a ceiling. Uh, I don't, they had to have some sort of ceiling. I don't know. I don't remember, but that's what, why there's a big hole there. And it's not like it's to the outside. This is the loft right here. So, yeah. that's some custom cutting right there. Look at that. My bit is wearing out. And it's getting hard to get a bite on these things. I gotta find another one. Because it's about stripped out. That's why I hate Phillips heads. Oh. Yes, come on out. Oh, there's me some stove wire. Probably still good. But I ain't putting in a stove now. All right, I think before I close all this back up, I'm going to put in some sort of, I don't know, some kind of a barrier so I don't have a mouse highway there. And this was where the old electrical box used to be, the service panel. So if I decide to tear this stuff off, you'll see it. All right, man. Woo! Let's get going. You're wondering where I'm putting all the wood? Right here. A lot of this will be going back in when I do the metal ceiling. I lock myself in. I hate this thing with a passion. I'm going to show you why I'm working inside today, guys. Look at all that smoke. It's been like that all week. And you stay out here in this smoke, man, your lungs start burning. It's awful. Yeah, so that's why I'm working in the house. Oh, this thing just quit working. 
Okay, so now I'm gonna take a knife, get in there. Uh, I'm gonna change it today. All right, a lot of these screws hit the ground. So I just take my magnet, pick them all up. What a mess this stuff makes. All right, man, these are becoming a fight right in here. Because that's going inside where that beam, the top of that beam, man, it's... That last one kicked my honey. Listen, chair. There ain't room in this town for me or you together. Now get on out of here. All right. Fortunately, every other one, there's two little boards, and that's a lot easier to get out. Go the right way. And the screws are shorter. Alright. This is not a not a fun task. And I remember putting them up. It wasn't fun putting them up either. But if you ever do this with lumber from the lumber yard, let it cure first. I didn't do that with this. And it shrunk. Alright. Chair, you're in my way again. Yeah, hopefully I can weasel this one out of here. Well, that ain't a short one. But nice. Gotta get it at the right angle. Shoulders are about to fall off. What? I, I need a screwdriver to get it started, I guess. Hog butter. I ain't giving up on that. I'm getting you. Get up here and get some leverage on you. I gotta see. Uh huh. You're angled out that way. All right. Tell you what I'm talking about. Oh, oh. Well, you didn't get those screws out. There's two here, too. Short one. Oh. Getting ahead of myself. Drop to the floor. Um, okay, let's see how hard this one is to get out. Well, I'm going to have one heck of a mess tonight. Okay. Obviously, I put that up after the ceiling. Whew. All right, we're getting there. But I'm taking a few out, and I'm going to go sit down, and I'd come take a few more out. Because not only is it boring, but it ain't no fun. Well, that about means the same thing, but... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more rows. And it might get a little tricky up here. Because I've got a wall. No, I see those have been notched. <coughs> them will be easy. i got to take all this crap down. <laughs> well, you guys like that new carport, don't you, Millie? Yeah, I park over to the side just for that reason, so you guys can lay under there, get in the shade. Now, I know what you want, and it's early. It's too early. So you guys just wait a while. Millie, you don't gotta leave. <laughs> Silly girls. All right, man. Now, I'm telling you. Every one of them dudes above that beam is a battle. Whoo! What happened to my camera? I don't know. Every one of them's a battle. But I'm getting them. Slowly but surely. Oh, what a mess in this place. Yeah. Oh. This will also give me an opportunity if I want to make any changes to the electrical. I can do that. 
I don't really see much changes coming other than maybe some switches and lighting so and I'm not sure when I put these up against that metal yeah see it's gonna stick out a little but I you know these are so thin I don't think it's gonna matter it'll look okay and it'll look good because it has that lighted side so you really want them to stick out a little and there's other ideas I've seen you take you cut the bottoms out of coffee cans and raise them up I just want to drill a small hole feed the wire through it and stick those up if I can do that so we'll see I'm going to be doing a whole video on that, so you guys will see how I do it in that video. There you go, your royal roosterness. You have turkey, chicken, and a medley of cheese. I said there's cheese on your plate. <clears throat> medley of cheese. For your royal roosterness. Right on the cheese. That's good for what ails you. Oh, I tell you what. Alright, I got 98% of it off. There's a few more boards to take off there. I'm done for the day. I'm going to barbecue out some chicken. Some barbecue chicken. I got spaghetti squash baked beans we're just gonna relax for the rest of the day I'll finish this up tomorrow and tomorrow we're gonna start building these walls getting the electric run and then I'll make a trip uh, probably not gonna put the ceiling up until the walls are all done and I gotta figure out if I want to leave this exposed like that it ain't hurt nothing because it's the loft above it but I guess once the roofs, the metal's on there, it ain't gonna matter anyway. And if I need to get in there in the future to work on electrical, it's pretty pretty easy to get it out. But as, as it does in the kitchen, the metal will be running long ways like this. Well, what I'll do is I'll measure the distance from here to there, and that's probably, I don't know, a five foot piece. So I'll get them in five foot pieces. Now where I go to buy them, I can order them, I can order like these in one piece. But I think five foot pieces will do it. I'll get my measurements and go pick that up. That's at another end of town in Mina. And then I'll go to Fort Smith probably or Russellville for the Home Depot. Pick up everything else I need. Uh, and order the cooktop if they don't have something there. So, all right. I don't know how long this video was today. But I'm trying, you know me, I record, uh, I try to record every step of the way. And, well... We're just about done with demo and ready to start getting this thing whipped back into shape. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Happy trails. Bye. Got milk bones, girls. Yeah, you don't have to call them twice for milk bones. Hold on. Don't take my fingers. That's Lily that does that. Oh, my God. Look at the smoke, guys. At least the dogs are down low to the ground. They're not they're not getting it. Wow. I'll be glad when they're done with this. I know it's necessary, but it gets old. Oh, I got two more milk bones to pass out. They're not hogs like you guys. They're probably not done eating yet. Oh, it's like I always have a pile of wood to contend with. There they are. I want to see what you guys are up to in here. Right. Easy, Lily. Don't you take my fingers off. Well, she will, too. She'll take them right off. All right. Ah.